Your second victory against Ryusha. Is it extremely satisfactory to beat one of the young talents? Yes, very. Well, again, I'd like to thank the Lord for an amazing win, always after a win. That's my main priority. Um, but uh, yeah, it's clear that Firoz is the next big talent. I mean, he's uh, probably underrated right now, considering how he's playing. And it's amazing all the things he does, he does because he's only 16. And he's fighting already with the world's best. And uh, well, today you lured him to your territory. I mean, this was typical your position, wasn't it? Well, I hope so. I mean, I'm trying to play all kinds of positions well, but obviously there are some positions that I prefer, and there are some positions that I'm happier than others. But basically, my in my chess, I'm trying to be an all-around level player. But it was, it was his choice to play for the Queen's Gambit accepted. Yeah, but I mean, this type of ending, it might not be winning, but you like to play it. I mean, that's what I think. But what do you say? Yeah, I, I don't, I don't, I certainly don't mind playing it. But uh, yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's good. I just don't want to be a one-sided player just to be good at endings and stuff. But, uh, but yeah, I mean, I prepared this line and then uh, it's probably a little bit better for White. And he, then he made some, you know, courses because he made some moves that I didn't expect. Like would never have popped in my head, like knight a7 or, or rook takes c8, rook takes c8, knight c8. Or, uh, but again, he played uh, really well. And then at some point, he, I think he was outplaying me. So I was ready more or less to go to a more or less equal endgame. But uh, because when he played queen d5, this queen is very active there and it's very well centralized. So I had to get rid of it. And the endgame is probably just a little better for white, but not much. I thought he can play f6 and king f7 instead of playing knight e4 and, and knight c5 because he, in the end his pieces are too active and I think he missed bishop c3 also and then he was uh, his knight was trapped and he was losing a pawn then the question is whether he could draw or not but uh, but he got really low on time and he wasn't able to to hold in the end three out of four that must give a good feeling yeah, yeah, it's uh, definitely very good, a good way to start the year. I'm uh, hoping to have a successful tournament here because um, my last few, few tournaments last year have uh, been pretty much uh, subpar. Like I was playing horrible chess back in October, September, August, blah, 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 blah. So I'm hoping this would be a new, a new chapter, but... Uh, uh, but again, chess is uh, a difficult uh, game, requires a lot of patience, requires a lot of work. Uh, it uh, requires a lot of preparation, a lot of energy and all that. And that's why there are only a few top players in the world. <laughs>